called a smart traffic signal designed to keep traffic flowing in one of the busiest corridors around here. But drivers say it's actually doing the opposite, causing them to wait even longer to get a green light. John Shumway joins us live now with a look at what's going on. John. Yeah, the adaptive traffic system has been in operation about six months or so here on McKnight Road. And while the main line moves pretty well, the folks who queue up on the side streets are raising questions about just what kind of priority they're getting. It's beginning to look a lot like McNightmare up and down the road. Oh, the holiday season on one of Pittsburgh's busiest shopping corridors. And for the first time this holiday season, the McKnight Road adaptive traffic signals are in operation, designed to continually adapt to the ever-changing traffic volumes we have on a roadway. The cameras and radar systems see the traffic and change the timing of the lights to adapt. We find probably about 95% of the time it does. However, there are times when we have heavier volumes of traffic that maybe it doesn't work as well as we would like to see it. Since it's designed to give preference to the heaviest flow of traffic. It might shut off a side street or a left turn lane because the time set too short. Case in point, on Saturday, a driver complained that this left off of McKnight near Bed Bath & Beyond only allowed two cars per green arrow. We went back through and looked at the logs, and we found for those left turn lanes, the minimum time was set for eight seconds. So, after eight seconds, the signals changed. We timed that same light today, and it's been adjusted to 20 seconds when the lane is full, 15 if it's not quite full. We can raise those minimum times up to accommodate for that. Yeah, they can do that if they know where there are problems, and that's where you, the driver, comes in. And it's true for here on McKnight, as well as the other adaptive traffic systems in Monroeville, Murraysville, and the Wexford Flats. Coming up new at 6.30, I'll tell you what you can do if you've discovered a problem in one of these systems, how, who you contact, and what you need to tell them. And especially here on McKnight Road, they need to know because of something that's happening next year. Tell you about that at 6:30 as well. For now, live on McKnight Road in Ross Township, John Shubway, KDKA TV News. All right.